have didn't didn't man franklin was well, oh we got pop yep. right his mind was over there and then uh reed had just uh paged him yep by his pop so 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 he he thinking about that you said his pops and she came in with the uh once you just have a broker once you just broker a deal you know call call man boy like hold up how did he how did you notice man boy all this like I know, and it he, just, she started talking too much and moment it just clicked for him he was like oh i'm getting played i'm getting yep played. yep in that moment yeah. because she you know what she started getting really sloppy because man boy put that pressure on her if she just kept like yep. if he wasn't putting pressure on her and just letting her to keep playing her role kept doing it she eventually got it to the point where he got the information but everybody on a time clock everybody trying to push especially with you know what I'm saying Lua getting getting shot everything's just in a, in a rush now like everything in a rush everything in a rush but you know it's crazy how like uh how uh man boy sister she the wild card bro she is the wild card of the show bro she can't be controlled she out she out for blood and yeah she can't be controlled bro she can't and she came and right after they was in the barbershop and man boy told her told her what he was trying to do yep she still was like fuck that I gotta go get him. I'm a not not just be smart about it. I'm gonna shoot up the whole damn funeral. I'm going to get him. I gotta get Come him. Come on, bro. Because like, when in, in that scene you said in the barbershop, it seemed like Scully was just so subdued. He like he just like 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 you know what I'm saying. Normally because last couple episodes we when we saw him, we he see y'all amped up. You know what I'm saying? Amped up, yeah. Did it go? But then when he was sitting in the barbershop, he just like chilling. Like he don't have. Yeah. It. He was like, you want sneaky conniving nigga. <laughs> But he's that little conniving nigga. <laughs> he said he ran in scheming. See, that's the thing, you know what I'm saying? Man boy. Yeah, scheming, yeah. But uh Scully just wanna get out there and just kind of like do it by brute force. You know what I'm saying? And, and his sister just like thinking she's just so and so enraged and so so emotional that she not she and that's not, what I don't get. But then she don't care about the drug. She don't care about the drug because she ain't hustling. You know what I'm saying? Man right. plug. You know what I'm saying? But she want to she want to buy it. She want Leon for the death of her daughter. So she out there being right. you know, she emotional. She out, she just enraged. But man boy, like, man, we need to plug because we get the plug. We're gonna replace him. She, you know, man yeah. said, man, he already how you think he's slipping through? How you think he's slipping through all the trouble? He the, you know what I'm saying, the murder and all that. You know what I'm saying? He dancing with the devil. Yeah. But I am I'm, I'm I'm still tripping with Scully. Like, Scully, that was your daughter. But like you said, that was your daughter, Scully, you sitting there. Like you said, subdued, just laid back, chilling. You ain't made you made one move to go get Leon, but that was it. Everything else been this girl. His girl been got fat back. Shot, we try to get him at the funeral. Been pressing the issue, bro. She you been, know what I mean? She been pressing the issue. She been pressuring. She been putting pressure on them boy, man. So that's the whole that's the whole ordeal. Where like if she would just to calm down and just let things kind of play out, how man boy's trying to make it, how to try man boy trying to play it. Cause yeah, like I said, I got things in motion, but they never was showing what he had in motion. But what he had in motion was he had the chick on Franklin. You know what I'm saying? Franklin. Yeah, he got he got the chick in Franklin ear. He's she smashing him. You know what I'm saying? He's smashing her. You know what I'm saying? He he eventually gonna do some pillow talking and let him know slip and say something. But, yeah, because the nigga crying in front of her and all that old shit. You know what I'm saying like he's he about to say something. He gonna slip and say something, but you know what I'm saying? He just ain't being patient enough. And then all of a sudden, things just started getting the timeline, everything got pushed up, and she just started slipping. She just started talking, just doing too much, bro, trying to be so- That was man boy though, like you said, like you said, yeah. man boy come in, shooting in her apartment, like nigga, man boy, calm down, bro. Like, not now man boy getting antsy. And man boy, cause cause you know what, cause he can't control his sister. Can't control his sister, now he getting antsy. Like we gotta hurry up because you know, basically that what he thinking. We gotta hurry up and get the plug because she gonna fuck up. She gonna fuck it all up. Yeah, because then you, because then you know, because Jerome he out for blood too. You already know he out for blood. But Lua gets hey. he out for blood. That nigga, he for nigga. Damn, he like that nigga Jerome. He said, that nigga, fuck Franklin. Yeah, that nigga, fuck Franklin. Then it came down with that Jerry Curl dripping boy. Let's hey. Like, he said, we're going to get them headhunt niggas. <laughs> we're going to go to the projects get the straps. Hey. Yeah. Hey, 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 it's on. It's on. Hey, you can't tell. Hey, he finna be like, now nah, he finna be like old girl. He finna be enraged, bro. He like, he finna go, he finna go cap some, bro. He finna go get something, bro. And, and this, nigga, this nigga, Franklin, dumb as hell. This nigga, tell Leon, don't let, don't let uh, Jerome leave. <laughs> Leon wouldn't ask Jerome for help. You think he, he looked at Leon like, nigga, you better come on. Like, exactly. Leon was like, shit. 
you know? Exactly. You know what I'm saying? So, he, he, he ain't going to better stop Jerome, man. Jerome on Warpath. Man, man, Lou, that's his baby. That's his baby, bro. Leah, hey. Huh? He was already, Jerome already was at odds with him. Yeah. The only reason he was like, okay, this is family. It's my nephew. You know, it's benefit of the doubt. But he already had odds with him. So, it was like, now that's his baby shot? Are you talking about chill? Nigga. He, hey, he like, bro, come on, bro. All right, nephew, you better remember who I am. Go what did he tell Louis and him? I'm putting all you bitches on notice. That's what he told But all you bitches don't notice. You forgot who the fuck I am. Hey, that's how, that's what he was saying. Because he had, who the fuck I am. He had been kind of like, he had toned down. You know, he was like I said, he was, he was hustling a little weed. He chilling. He was mm-hmm. making a little money getting by. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Loving his old lady. Loving Louis. He chilling. Loving Louis. You know what I'm saying? You know? Gucci his life. Everything. Hey. Then he coming here with his coat. Turned them up a little bit. They got some money. Brought them problem to him. Got them bodies. Body mm-hmm. start falling. Oh, it, it, it shit didn't change, man. That shit didn't change. Shit didn't change. And he found out that the CIA he lied to him about the CIA plug and all that. Oh, he he was already at odds with him. Yeah, he hey he like you said and, and like you said he was the one back in the day saying you know selling selling his little dime sacks or whatever. He was the one that you know everybody respected. Jerome, yeah. remember Franklin could even go over to Jerome House. Miles would even let him go over there. Cause he know what he was doing over there. You know he was over there hustling, getting money. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, he, he was. He was like, nigga, you was a little square. Now you try to tell me, bro. He like, bro, like she was like, I putting all you bitches on notice. Like you know, like you forgot who I, nigga. I'm Jerome. Yeah. I walk around with the see through tank top, nigga. Like you know, with my, with my with my nipples out and shit. You know what I mean, nigga? You forgot who I am, nigga. Like you I, know what I mean? Oh, I get it. I get it. All oh, y'all. Oh, all of it, bro. So yeah, <laughs> hey, Jerome, like you said, that boy, hey, he on a war path. He don't give a damn. He don't care. You know, Cause they up there waiting on him with the Uzis, choppers, everything, waiting on him. Wait. He like, I don't give a damn. He ain't thinking, man. And like, frankly, like he know he ain't thinking, you know what I'm saying? He just emotional. And he gonna just, you know what I'm saying? Make a make a, a rash the shiz and offer to just run over there. You gonna get shot up, you gonna get killed, but they waiting on you. Yeah, yeah. I just don't care about none of that shit. None of that. He like, I'm finna go get some blood. I gotta get his blood. It's back. Go get it back in blood. How Pooch likes to say, I'll get it back in blood. Back in blood, bro. And, and back in blood. I gotta get this back. You shot my baby. She might not live. She, you finna go. Man, boy, messed up though. Man, boy, sister though. Yeah, man, boy, sister fucked up. Do I? She, she, she already now they know who it is. You know what I'm saying? They know who it is. But I and I think Franklin gonna try to. He, I don't think he's gonna kill her right off the bat. I think he's gonna just scare and make her make her say something and try to make another play for to get man boy in the trap. But I, I think I, I I don't think he's gonna be up on Franklin. I wouldn't trust her. I wouldn't trust her though. Yeah, but I don't think he's gonna be up up to Franklin. I think Jerome will get to her before Franklin. I'm talking about uh, I'm talking about the girl. I'm talking about old girl. Like I don't yeah. Think, uh, uh, I think Jerome. Nobody known that. Nobody know at this point. No, nah, Leon knew it. Remember, he said that was that girl mama. No, I'm saying, I'm saying, I'm saying, like uh, when Franklin went to the house, knew that she was basically setting him up and playing. Him. I don't think nobody. Oh, that girl. Oh, T. You talking about T? Yeah, I don't think nobody okay. know, know but him. So I think what he gonna do? I don't think he gonna kill her right off the bat. I think he gonna use her to try to set up man boy and all them. But I don't think I, I wouldn't trust her though. I wouldn't trust her because yeah. she. If he don't kill her, bro. He ain't if he don't kill her. He's stupid. He's stupid. Because if most people, they would have killed her right there in the chair. You know what I'm saying? If it had anybody else, they would, if it had been anybody else. When she was laying down in the chair, looking up at the ceiling, they would have just stood over, put the bullet in the head, walked out the house. But now he gonna try to, you know what I'm saying, ration world or try to get her set somebody up. But it ain't gonna work. It ain't gonna work. You see how, you see how, you see how, you see how old boy came to the house, gave that money back to to uh, Franklin mom. She was uh, giggling, she excited. He like, uh, got something. Yeah. We're not gonna be able to meet. She get pull that money. Me. What's going on? She about to leave. Oh, but she, I, she done. She gonna leave with uh oh oh uh, uh what's the name of oh, Kirby Kirby whatever the name was he, he already did he think he already did she talking about she don't want she gonna go get her another house somewhere trying you know what I'm saying she don't want to be in between them no more like now nah, it, it's serious in that man Louis, yeah, it's too late for it's too late for that they ain't in the real estate game no more and, and he got man Franklin got a lot on his plate bro he, he got a lot of moving parts going on around there bro like on wow. and how he, how he able to function bro I would not be able to sleep bro. Cause he got Reed. Reed, Reed gonna get all that shit taken care of with the paper, the reporter. Long as he, long as Franklin able to bring him that money, Reed gonna take care of him. You're right. But see, Franklin ain't who he ain't moving no weight right now. He can't. I don't know what they do in the Little Rock. 
they ain't even they probably just barely started. Yeah, they probably on pause down there because they ain't they them two keys ain't gonna hold them over that long. Right? Not, not, yeah, jumping off off the rip. Yeah, so he gotta get back to he gotta get back to work, man. He should have just he gotta go. He gotta kill Scully and Man Boy off top. He gotta kill him. That's the only way. He gotta kill and the, and the girlfriend. He gotta kill all three of them, bro. He do, he do. But here's the thing, bro. Who 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 who, who gonna replace him? Who gonna replace him for that money? It gonna be. He don't need nobody replacing because he's got Jerome and 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 all them. It's like you know what we, man boy Scully ain't here no more. We taking over. Yeah. Uh, he could put. He could take Hairbone. Put hair. He could put Leon over there. Let Hairbones take the projects. Yep. Right. Yep. Put Leon over Compton. I mean, I, what is it? What is it? Uh, Wood. Inglewood or the other spot where uh, uh, Scully at? Yep, you got to, bro. You got to kill all three of them, bro. That's the only way you. That's, that's the only way you can make this work right now, bro. You got to. You got to. You got to handle all three of them, bro. Otherwise, he gonna just forever have problems with them. Ain't no. Ain't no negotiating with them no more. You. You way past negotiation at this point. Way past. You got to kill a. Uh, what's the name? Uh, Tamika, whatever the girl, the, the baby mom. I call her wild child. She a little, she a wild yeah. girl, bro. She the wild. She got to go first, cause she the one that's she the one that's been hitting. But pull it, man. She out there causing problems, causing havoc for them, bro. She putting that pressure on them, bro. She comes, she don't pressure cut the girl. You know what I'm saying? At the funeral home, bro. Like you gotta be drive by the funeral home, boy. You like you don't give a fuck. You don't give a. You don't, you don't care, bro. And so, hey, but frankly, bro, that's frankly fault, bro. That's frankly fault, bro. Awful. There's no way. There's no way. You roll up to the to that to that uh funeral with just you and Peaches. Outside, bro. Outside. You just standing outside, bro. There was no way he posted me. I'd have came through the back door, side door. I would have walked if even if I came through front, I'm like coming in and gonna get straight in the building. I'm not gonna be hovering outside when I know it's a hit out on us. Or or yeah. Or even bro, come on, man. You supposed to come in with a with a uh what do they call it? With a with a brigade. You supposed, yeah, have, you supposed to come in with about five, six cars with you. Bro, you supposed to have posts. And, you post, and then the thing is, you, you're not even supposed to have nobody on the block, let anybody on the block without getting shit, dog. Like, you ain't Because she was just sitting in the car, bro. She's sitting in the car. In the distance, just looking and watching them. And soon he pulled up, they're like, oh, there you go right there. They go Leon right there. Oh, Frankie, too. Oh, we finna go get them all right now. Go, go get, get everybody. All. We go get everybody. Right. Let's go. Exactly. He posted. He posted. Everybody, he posted. He ain't even supposed to pull up there until two, three cars are already there, like you said, and check the whole perimeter. Check everything. everything. Everybody in the car, all the niggas walking around. Bro, you got a bounty on your head. Bro, for real, bro. You don't know who's who in there. You supposed to check everybody. Every you're supposed to be one way in, one way out, and you gotta go through my people to come in here. Hey, bro, cause they came in there trying to lay it down, bro. They lay yeah. sitting in the car watching. And they out there. Watching. And they out there talking like they ain't got no hits on them or nothing. Like, bro, you got we, it's heat out here, man. Let's get in this building, man. Let's get in inside. You can be standing out yeah. there. Man, thank y'all for showing up, bro. Let go. Let's get inside. All right, man. You thank me. Let go. Let's, Let's get go. inside. Yeah, you got Louie and them out there reconciling. You know, my baby about to be here. Man, if you don't get your ass inside this this church, man. What's wrong with y'all? He was just fussing at them just then before, not even going, because she was telling them from the door, like, don't go. You, we got heat on us. You already know what time it is when you go out there. Don't do it. They gonna be out there waiting on you. Don't do it. And then Don't she all her own advice and she goes out there tipping. I then she she go out there with a sad puppy dog face like we're gonna make mm-hmm. up like, my baby. And that time you know, pop, 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 pop. Yeah. Let them Damn, line it up. You know niggas don't listen, bro. Niggas don't listen. You know niggas gotta, like you said, you, Nigga gotta be, you nigga gotta poke his chest out. And putting all you bitches on notice, poke his chest out, even knowing damn well she was right. Knowing damn well she was right. Don't take your Jerry Curl juice having ass up out there with them niggas out there. They gonna be, you, you, you a sitting duck. Yep. You know what, but she, what she said, you know what? My man here, I'm riding with my man. I'm gonna be here for you. Look, now she, she on the ground laid out. You know what I'm saying? She up there 